Fire department is investigating a two alarm fatal fire on the city's northwest side. That fire engulfing two homes Monday morning. Christina Van Zels joining us live near 34th and Lisbon, where firefighters were back in the neighborhood today, this time working to stop this from happening to anyone else. Christina? Yeah, those firefighters were going door to door today in this neighborhood offering fire safety tools, whether that be checking smoke alarms or offering free ones and reinstalling other ones. This was all after the fire department says that there have been seven fire fatalities just this year. Rubble and a pile of debris is what's left of this Milwaukee home on 34th Street. It's the aftermath of a two alarm fire that spread to two homes Monday morning. The first and second floors collapsed inside. The fire department says the smoke and fire was so intense they had to fight the fire from the outside. That made it difficult to get to the man who was trapped inside. It was very hard for us to have to wait hours before we were able to enter and find the patient. That man, a 75 year old, died. A 12 year old boy also had to go to the hospital after breathing in too much smoke. A third home was evacuated as a precaution. Per the family, there were smoking, uh, working smoke detectors inside the house. Um, when we drove up, there was so much damage, we could not hear them. While the fire is still under investigation, firefighters are going door to door, checking for working smoke alarms and installing new ones for free. Thank you for walking down the street. Change your batteries regularly. Give us a call. Uh, smoke detectors are free. And I'm glad it did come in because we did have one that didn't work. The neighborhood canvas, part of Project Focus, firefighters out creating urban safety. And neighbors are grateful they did, especially those who didn't know their smoke alarms didn't work. They tall enough where they can get up there and get some things done. So I really appreciate that part of it. Investigators are still looking into how Monday's fire started. Now, if you need a smoke alarm installed, there is a hotline you can call. We have that number at fox6now.com. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News. All right, Christina, thanks very much.